Hello everybody, my name is Stanley111 and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. So, we are in our room in the Atomic Wrangler right now. And what we're going to do today, we're going to go into data, data quests, kill Mr. House. Mr. House, you're going to get out the picture and, um, yeah, let's uh, kill him. Let's have some fun with this. So how are we all doing? How has your day been? Um, I've been writing a script today. Yep, I know, script, right? <laughs> I'm kidding, of course. I'm um, not making no sort of jokes. I'll try to avoid them. But um, I've been making a script for a Witcher 3 video. Well, just a Witcher video. Not sure if that's going to go up before this. I should have probably recorded it today, but I can't be bothered. It's been my birthday weekend, and I thought, well, I don't fucking care. I'm wanting to relax a little bit. I played for, uh, on Friday on my birthday. I played some Fallout as well. Did a video, quick video, and um, obviously in uh, yesterday, I was it yesterday? Well, I yeah, yesterday I played uh, Dragon Age Inquisition multiplayer and I uploaded that. It's actually going up today, the Sunday. Um due to upload speed and stuff, you know, I'm always at least a day or two behind. Right, let's have a little look at what Mr. House has got to say for himself. And by say for himself, I mean just say, because we kind of been an asshole to him. By uh, what happened last episode which, uh, just to catch you up, we destroyed... <laughs> ah, shit. Oh, Victor, man! We were buds. We were buds. A long time ago, in a galaxy. Far fucking away. Right, charge. A strip can suck my legion balls. Because, yeah, I'm with the legion, obviously. This is a legion playthrough, or let's play it, or whatever. Right. Time to kick these guys' asses. Two on one. Let's see, you gonna get your thing out? Yes, yeah, your thing. Oh, hello. Getting low on health. Good old healing powder. Can help us a little bit. And use one little uh, stun pack. Secure Tron. Thank God that I didn't upgrade you before I destroyed it, because that would have been extremely stupid, considering that you're more power. You would be more powerful, and you'd be part two, and you'd have rockets and shit. All right, let's have some water. Purified water. Let's go to the penthouse suite. Don't know if there's any secure trons there, but we can get a rest, we can get a sleep, and we can heal ourselves back up for the charge. Oh, this isn't penthouse, this is oh this is penthouse. Presidential suite is where I want to be. Ah. <sighs> Do I think I've actually been here in this Let's Play? But yeah. Don't know. Oh, scotch. We always love a good bit of alcohol. Don't know what. I, I can't remember what happens with the Legion Let's Play because I didn't really come back here because I didn't really need to. Let's do. 13 hours. Should do a trick. Do the trick. Nah, maybe. Now, by the time we've killed off house, eh, we should be fine. We should be back into daytime. Yeah, we're in daytime. We're, we're in definitely in daytime. Time, 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 time. Oh, shit. I need... I think we need, might need science. Right, we can go for it. We can run. Right, come on. Oh, we don't need to. 
Charge this. Get it open, get it open, get it open. Come on. Time to die. Control room. Thank God. Because <laughs> if I did, if I didn't go, look how low we are in HP. Now it's just running through that. It's hard to see because it's all blurred out, but that is Mr. House in there. Let's open her up. Unseal the LS chamber. Yes, yes, yes. Hello, Mr. House. Welcome back to civilization. You like that fresh oxygen? It's not really fresh, but Jesus, I didn't really look up here before. Damn. I thought you'd uh, be a rich man, would have given himself better living conditions. Let's see what you got to say. Why have you done this? Centuries of preparation. So much good undone. Sorry. By Kaiser's command, you will die. Slavery. The future of mankind. What have you done? It'll put you back into your chip and you'll be good as new. No! Ruined everything! Exposed germs! A year of life! If at most, I have nothing. I've got nothing to. S oh, sorry. Did I cut you off there? Lost karma. Who fucking cares? Worth the fucking legion, bitches. We lose karma. The house has come fast. Right, let's use medicine up again because we seem to be going awfully low on health all of the time. Intense training. Swift learner. Well, I am. that is a quest that you cannot actually pass, I think. Because as soon as you kill him, it finishes. Right. Right, I need to return to Kaiser, and I'm pretty sure these guys will not really care now, because, uh, I was going to say, what do you think you're doing? Welcome, Mr. House. Yes, I am Mr. House. Connection has been lost. Like, uh, all right. Aw, you're no longer that woman chick. All right, let's go back to the presidential suite, the prezi, and get ourselves some sleep again. Because, where is it? Yeah, it's here. Um, because it's obviously we uh, lost some health in there. Always uh, good to redeem yourself with health. Now we can actually see. Whoop, whoop. All right, go down to the casino floor. And I want, I'm curious to see what Yes Man has to say now that he's dead. I can't remember if I've done this. There's so many ways you can do this game. It's unbloody believable. And that's why this game, along with Fallout 3, are on nearly they're, they're joint top for my favorite game so there's, there's a few games that are joint top but this is one of them and it deserves it, it deserves every little bit of praise it gets every little bit all right let's have a little talk to swank so all of a sudden i'm hearing word that mr house ain't the boss of vegas Baby, that's just not square. Oh. I thought I could uh, say something about Benny. Like me beating the shiza hooting out of him. 
Right, let's have a little look. Where is Mr. Yes Man? He usually stands outside, but I'm not sure because... Let's press it. No. We're not in the presidential. We're going up to Benny Suite. The boss man suite. I'm essentially the boss of uh, this place now. Hey, he is still here. Hello. Oh, hi again. What was pl uh, Benny planning to oh. do? Yes, we don't care. I've already. You're very forthcoming. Yes. I've already done this. The details Again, of the plan. Goal number one is to eliminate Mr. House and install my okay. computer. Given how you're a new arrival, I also recommend that you All right. Mr. House is already out of the picture. You already took care of Mr. House? Wow, you work fast. I sure do. I mean Benny was always scheming about how he was gonna get into the lucky thirty eight, but you already took care of that. Wow. The other thing you're going to need is the platinum chip. You know, the one Benny killed a courier for over near Good Springs. Do you know, what do you know about that courier that Benny shot? I knew he was carrying a platinum chip, and I knew right where Benny should wait for him. That's why Benny put me here, to monitor Mr. House's data transmissions. They're all encrypted, of course, but I'm quite a decryptor. Okay. Did you know that Mr. House spent 812,545 caps hiring salvage teams to find the platinum chip just in the last year alone of course you didn't or that there were seven couriers but six of them were carrying junk how about their exact routes and the mercenary teams that screened them i knew all that pretty smart huh i'm the courier that benny shot <laughs> i know that's not true because you still have a head. I'm serious. <laughs> That's not funny, you getting shot in the head. I really shouldn't have taken so much pride in how I set that up, huh? I feel really bad right now. You set me up. No, it's time for you to die. I feel really bad telling you this, but I kind of can't die. I mean, go ahead and destroy this Securitron. Get it out of your system. The problem is that a distributed image of my neurocomputational matrix is backed up to the network several times a day or when I'm threatened. I can't help it. There's a little bit of me in every Securitron on the strip. So if this instance gets destroyed, I just download to a new one. If I could stop it from happening, I would. I mean, your vengeance is going to feel so incomplete. I have the platinum chip, remember? Of course you do. Sorry about that. And it's wonderful that you do. The platinum chip is the key to overriding and exploiting Mr. House's defenses. Did I just say exploiting? That's not a very nice word. Chip was supposed to be a to activate an army of Securitrons at the fort, but I blew it up. You blew it up? That's just funny because that army seems like the secret weapon that was the whole point of, you know. I really admire how you stack the odds against yourself. Yeah, big things challenging. It's great, really, yeah. So, anyway. Okay, goodbye. Let's test out that theory of yours. Serves me right. Back to the drawing boards. Right. So that's him dead. But is he dead? Now he'll probably appear downstairs. Um at the front door of the top, so we'll just say, we won't say anything to him, we'll say hello and then just goodbye. But uh, we've got to go see Kaiser, because Kaiser has something for us, and by that I mean XP, and we always need some good XP, don't we? 
So he would be over there, but I'm just going to come out here. Yes, hello. Right. So just say hello. I'm nice. Kind of. Sometimes. Let's go to the fort. To see good old Grandmaster Kaiser. Kaiser, Kaiser. So... By oh. order of Kaisar, all visitors... Okay. I agree to disarm. Your belongings will... Wait, what? Ah, I... Oh. Must have removed them. Ah, wait. Are you ready to... Oh, goodbye. No, I don't need to. I've got fast... I've got my jetpack. <laughs> yeah. My uh, fast travel jetpack. Right, hey, yo. So let's go and say hello to. Ah, oh, I should know this. I've looked into the, the lore. What's his real name? Kaiser. Let's just call him John Kaiser's Legion. <laughs> right, um. Let's just talk to Kaiser. Call him Kaiser because that's his name in the game. Right. Oh well, yeah, if you're ever against Kaiser's Legion and you want a really good fight, and well, you want to have a little—not well, really good fight—you want a little bit of a fight and also want a ton of XP. Get Swift Learner three, three versions of it, and come here and just murder the shit out of everyone. Force them into slavery. See how they like it. Hello, Mongol. How are you doing today? Hello. Hello. Sire? I've read Mr. House's obituary. Had a high opinion of himself, didn't he? With Mr. House out of the way, I can focus on smoothing out a few lingering complications elsewhere in the Mojave. First up are the boomers of Nellis Air Force Base, a tribe so reclusive it lobs artillery shells at anyone who comes near their settlement. I want you to offer them an alliance with my legion. My terms are simple. Target their guns against the NCR side of the dam when I assault it, and they can keep their freedom. If you find they aren't amenable to this offer, destroy them. I can handle the boomers for you. Good. Your first challenge will be to reach their settlement without getting blown up. After that, it should be easy. Very well. Off to Nellis Air Force Base. Here we go. So, some of you may not uh, know what it's like, but it, it, I've been there in real life. Um, well, I've seen it in real life, and it's it's alright. <laughs> it's alright. Eh, nothing special. Nothing spectacular. I mean, I didn't get shot art artillery rounds right at my face. So that's a bonus. Oh, these bloody mole rats, eh? Oh, Brahmin. You are... Oh no, you're after me. No ta, no ta. Da, da, da. Get my rebar club out. Goodbye, and damn, that is veiny. That's what she said. Oh! I thought that was dead for a second, because there's blood. 13 XP is, X is still XP. Every little helps. As Tesco say. Sponsor! Unpaid sponsor. <laughs> Uh, let's put you away. Right, uh, how long do we have? Because uh, I don't want to make it too long. Uh, five minutes. We'll make. We'll, we'll attempt to make it into the Nellis Air Force Base. And if we do not succeed, well, there's also a little thing called loading. We can do it again and again. And we'll rise and rise again until lambs become lions. 
if you can name that quote. I've already asked this question, but nobody answered. If you name the film from that quote, from the quote, the little, name the film or book that that quote is from. I will give you a cookie and a pat on the back, and I will talk to you forever. Whoa there, pal. Nobody cares. Whoa, simmer down. I've made some cash from gambling and some cash from. There is. Wager, let's hear it. Well, I know the secret to get past. If you give me the caps, I'll tell you. If you make it back alive. You got yourself a deal. Okay, here you go. That page has the details, but it's all in the timing as you. I'll be here watching, so I'll know if you've... Right, time to get 600 caps. Ladies and gentlemen, we're not even going to read it, because I already know. Freedom protection, blah, 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 do not come here or you will die. See? Nothing to do with the buildings. You just need to fucking sprint, son. Alright. Let's talk to this hole. Are they wearing... Th yes, they are. They're wearing power armor. Is that... Hold it right there. There they are. Don't you move. How the hell did you survive that bombardment? Because I'm Stally motherfucking 111. So, simple enough. Run, height, run. It's on the timing. But I had you zeroed in the whole time. Nobody's that fast. Move a muscle now, and I'll blow you to pieces. You see, I've got a little mod called Project Nevada, and that allows me to hit shift or whatever button I allocate to sprint, and I can sprint. That makes me faster than a regular person in Fallout New Vegas. So, um, abracadabra. Yeah. Then come here to attack you. Then just, just stay where you are. Raquel will be here any second. Okay. I'll take this from here. I'm Raquel, Master at Arms for the Nellis Homeland. Mother Pearl, our eldest, wishes to speak to you. Um. All right. Lead the way. Did Stay I? Close and did I add a, a mod? Why, like the Nellis Air Force Base, just decide to have power armor and like, well, wear god suits. Welcome, child. Took your sweet time getting here, didn't you? I've been waiting a good five years for an outsider to come along and visit. Well, you didn't exactly rule out the red carpet, did ya? Those howitzers of ours aren't just for entertainment, child. Explosive ordnance is what keeps the savages at a distance. Except you. There's something special about you, child. And it was the howitzers that gave you a chance to show it. Who may I be assistance, kind peril? Oh, so many ways. Small ones to begin with, so we can get used to what it's like to have a sev- uh, outsider around and about. Should that go well, it may be you can help in big ways, too. We'll have to see. How can we trust each other if you're going to be keeping secrets? You have to keep in mind that you're our first contact with the outside world since I was barely a woman. Seclusion has kept us safe, but the world around us is changing. Neon lights in the distance, patrolling robots, soldiers. My youngers think our guns can keep out the world, but I think we need to let it in just a little or become its victim. You're that little bit of the world, child. Welcome to Nellis. Thank you. Thank you for the welcome. Where do I start? You picked a good time to stop by, for we're swimming in problems. My youngers can tell you all about it. Raquel could use help with the bug problem. Doc Argyle has wounded he's tending to. And Loyal and Jack might be looking for help with some repairs. Or you could just go see Pete at the museum and hear the story of our people. All you have to do there is listen. 
Come and go as you like, help or don't help, I leave it up to you. But I hope you'll show my youngers that not every outsider needs to be blown up. Fair enough. Right, Volare! Yeah. Good song from, uh, I believe it was Dean Martin. Great man, great man, great man. Personally knew him myself, or toy. Was it, I think it is him. Evening. Anyway. It's either him and, or Sinatra Jr. Right, we are going to do one thing while we are here. We are going, well, until next episode, we're going to have a little look in the, uh, the museum. The Nils Boomer Museum. Let's listen to the grand story of the boomers. I've heard this story way, way too much. You're the outsider. Mother Pearl sent word that you'd be stopping by. You must be eager to hear the story of our people. Not really, kid. But, yeah, I'm trying to make myself useful. So I'd like to know Wonderful. Three people. I'm sure you've noticed the mirror on the wall of this hut. Shall I tell you what it all means? Don't really want to, but I can spare the time. I've got a few minutes left of this video. Excellent. Imagine you're the first outsider to ever hear our tale. <clears throat> Bet you that I'm not I'm the only first awesome outsider to he ever hear your tale. Boom. Well, I'm only Awesome, first awesome person to hear Ages your tale because you're all suck. Before I was born, we lived underground. Everyone had guns, but the overseer wouldn't let us explode anything, not even a hand grenade. We left and wandered the wastes. There were savages with knives. We blew them up with frag mines and grenades, burned them with flamethrowers. It was neat, but there was a downside. For every 43.6 savages we killed, we lost one of our own. We needed a new home. We needed Nellis. Here we have prospered and multiplied. Here our mighty guns destroy any savages who might try to harm us before they can even reach our gates. Well, until... But... Not saying you want to harm us or you're a savage, but anyways... Nellis has revealed many secrets. Right, I think this is way too quiet, so I'm gonna turn off voice. It has taught us how to fly the bombers once based here, and it has taught us where to find one. And that is our story so far. For this last image is our future. To restore the bomber, to fly the open skies in armored safety. Running high explosive ordnance upon ignorant savages. This is our destiny. I'm pleased that you listened to the entire story. Perhaps there are details you'd like to know more about. No, nope, no, nope, none, none. Okay, Bamers, Bam has been gained. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Stanley111, and this was Fallen New Vegas, the Legion playthrough part 18, there is it? 18 or 19. We've got we've done a few episodes the last couple of weeks. We're certainly catching up. I'm just getting uh, bored of other games really for much. And Fallout's a, always a safe bet, just not for views. Uh, but there's a few of you sticking at it. Um, and if you are still, you've watched a few of the episodes of the series. Drop a comment saying Fallout New, Ge New, Fallout New Vegas for the win, or something to do with that. Saying Fallout New Vegas is awesome, or you love the Legion playthrough or something like that. I um, just want to see if you've actually seen some of the episodes uh, before or this is your first or whatever. So thank you very much for watching. Next episode we will start by helping the folk of the, 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 the boomers at the Nellis Air Force Base. Can't even speak. Anyway, make sure to drop a like, drop a comment and subscribe if you've not done so already. My name is Dally111. You are my audience and you've been a great one. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next video. See ya.